Hi everyone, I've just come to share with you um, another little journal that I finished. Um, again, I started this one over a week ago, possibly two weeks ago, and this is me just getting around to getting it finished. Um, it's one of the clasp envelopes, um, which was the, not the huge ones, the six by nine, I believe. So this measures six that way by four and yeah just slightly under four and a half that way um the front cover has all been mod podged and it's um so it's waterproof and durable there's a little bit of lace on the spine so it's all um you can't see the um this stuff see i haven't done a video in ages i can't remember everything <coughs> linen thread which i used to sew in the signatures there's two chunky little signatures inside there um, we've got some banners here. The doily's been um, mod podged down too, and it says memories. Um, the back um, here, I keep saying, mm. um, I've lined the inside of the envelope <clears throat> with some polka dot paper um, so you can put things inside there. The clasp has been covered over with this um, kind of ledge paper, and I will do a flip through. Um, there's ledge paper on the inside cover as well so, and that's not been mod podged so you can actually write on that if you wish. Um, this will be listed in my Etsy and the link will be below. Um, so I've just got some journaling cards that I've attached with paper clips. I've um, got a banner here with um, <clears throat> a double layered butterfly. Some coffee dyed tags which have been stamped on. I've got a doily tuck there with a little flower. Um, some stamping, got a banner and a doily, <clears throat> there is plenty of places to journal. Um, I had to kind of stop adding things because as you can see it was getting rather chunky. Um, so we've got a, a belly band here and I got this idea from um, Denise who is Practice Makes Pretty here on YouTube. Um, she had seen one of her videos um, a while back and she'd she'd done this kind of layering. Um, <clears throat> So we've got some ephemera tags here that are just inked up around the edges with some eyelash trim. Here we've got a pocket. Um, I haven't put any tags inside because if I keep adding stuff, there will be no room for it to be <coughs> functional. Um, where's a tag? Okay, so it's opened at the back here like so. And you can also put things inside there. And you can tuck things inside there as well. So I'm just going to move this paper clip because I'm not liking where it is. Um, so it's best to keep the paper clip on some thicker paper and not on the doily. Yeah, so that's a double area for adding things. Here we've just got some <clears throat> designer paper which I've just created a little um, tuck spot. Um, doily and a, and a butterfly, some ephemera, some more stamping, um, this banner, <clears throat> a doily, some paper, got a doily tuck here and here so you can add things there. This is the centre of the signature and it's, I've just created a pocket and inside there is just a little um, envelope where you can pop some knots in there. <clears throat> here we have a pocket with some tags and a flower of the butterfly there. Um, oh, I need to add a little bit of um, eyelash trim onto there um, and I'll do that now in case I forget. Um, so there is plenty plenty places to um, to add to, to journal. Kind of cleared up a little bit <clears throat> so there we go there's the tag with its seam binding not seam binding eyelash trim um, some designer paper some stamping and I used um, distressed stain on that rather than the archival ink because it really does bleed right through um, whereas the distress ink doesn't another tag another one of these pockets and I will have all the um, 
like how many pages there were, etc., on my Etsy listing. Um, and that's a tuck there too. Another tag. Um, there's a postcard there. Another tag. Another banner with a double layered butterfly. These are like bookmarks, um, but you can journal on them as well. And that's the first signature. There's quite a few pages in there. Second signature, tag. We've got a banner here with a butterfly and a corner tuck here. Another one of these pockets, so it's opened at the back here and there and there and even in there. Another tag, another one of these belly bands here, the butterfly in the middle. These are a little sticky. Um, another tuck there and here. Another envelope inside the center pocket. <clears throat> Here we've got some ephemera pieces. You can journal on the backs of them. All the paper has been coffee dyed as well. <clears throat> Another tag. Some more stamping. Another one of these pockets so you can put things behind and in the pocket and behind the doily. Another one of these like bookmarks. I'm sorry the lighting isn't great but it's it's late um, so there's no real light coming through. Another tag and that is the end. So there we have it. Um, if you have any questions um, just ask. <clears throat> Thanks for watching. And if you are interested, um, the Etsy link will be in the description box. Bye.